claims of looming job cuts in the public sector has sent Kosatu into an uproar. The Trade Union Federation has threatened to withdraw its support for the ruling party. This is if government goes ahead with retrenchment plans. We view the plans to retrench workers as an act of ultimate betrayal, especially after the government decision to increase VAT after promising not to do so. This make a mockery of the alliance. If the ANC abandon its own manifesto and sabotage our dreams and aspirations as workers, we have no reason to support it. Kosatu says it plans to meet with the ANC's top six on the issue. The National Office Bearers of Kosatu to request an urgent meeting with the ANC top six to communicate a clear and uh, ambiguous message to them that workers will not vote against their interest in the upcoming national election. The union says workers' votes will not come for free. If the ANC will betray the interest of workers, workers will have to rethink their support on the ANC. It goes without saying. Our vote for the ANC is not free. Our vote for the ANC is for the ANC to continue to protect our interests. Kosatu is preparing for its 13th Congress to take place from the 17th to the 20th of September. The Federation will also hold a march against Impala Platinum, which plans to retrench thousands of workers. Kosatu did not mince its words, rather speculation of a public service retrenchment, but instead gave government and the private sector an ultimatum to put a monitorium on any looming job cuts until the job summit. Natasha Piri, Afro World View, Johannesburg.